Welcome to the biggest night in sports entertainment, bigger than the Super Bowl, bigger than the World Series. It's the granddaddy of them all. It's WrestleMania. And we're broadcasting live from East Rutherford, New Jersey at the MetLife Stadium. 94,000 fans are up on their feet screaming. The atmosphere is just absolutely electric. We have a great show for you guys tonight. Four main events. Our headliners is none other than that guy himself, John Cena, who's going to challenge the current WWE champion for his belt, The Rock, which is a rematch of last year's Wrestlemania main event. Welcome to Wrestlemania 20. We're just moments away from our main event Rock versus Cena but before we get into that let's recap what has happened tonight. Jack Swagger successfully defeated Alberto Del Rio and he is your new world heavyweight champion. Our next matchup was a no holds barred matchup between Triple H and Brock Lesnar which started in the parking lot of all places when Brock Lesnar essentially attacked Triple H and threw his head into a nearby car window. It took 10 referees to get these guys back in the ring. Once back in the ring Triple H was in trouble early and often as he was still visibly shaken from that head injury he just suffered moments ago. A condition of this match is that Triple H's 20 year Hall of Fame wrestling career is on the line. If he was to lose tonight he would be forced to retire from the WWE. However, Triple H will fight and crawl his way back into the driver's seat of this matchup. He will find the great equalizer in the sledgehammer. He would execute multiple rib shots to Brock Lesnar's midsection. If that wasn't good enough pedigree for good measure, Triple H will walk away the victor of this matchup. He and his career is good to fight for another day. This matchup will end in Brock Lesnar being carted away on a stretcher. CM Punk and Undertaker saga tonight started backstage when CM Punk cowardly attacked Undertaker, much like how he did last week on Raw. Justin Roberts caught up with Undertaker as Undertaker issued a challenge for CM Punk for their matchup to be a hell in a cell matchup. CM Punk happily accepted. Undertaker has an undefeated streak at all WrestleManias in his illustrious career. His streak stands at 19-0, which is on the line tonight. When you think of Hell in a Cell, you think of Undertaker. You think of Undertaker versus Mankind. You think of Undertaker versus Shawn Michaels. And tonight was no different, except that on this night, it was pretty much one way. Undertaker was simply manhandling CM Punk each and every way, choke slam after choke slam, tombstone after tombstone. Undertaker with a very impressive victory, his streak at WrestleMania still continues, it still lives on at 20 and 0. And now, the moment we've all been waiting for, the WWE Championship, Rock vs. Cena, let's get ready to wrestle! Here we go, WWE titles on the line. Rock starts it off with a spinning DDT. John Cena is dazed. This crowd of 94,000 is now getting behind Rock as they're chanting, Rocky, Rocky, Rocky. Irish whip into the corner, followed by the big chop by The Rock. Rock is building momentum with the suplex. WWE titles once again on the line. This is a rematch of last year's WrestleMania main event where The Rock won. Rock would quickly cover Cena, but Cena with the kick out. John Cena earned his shot at the title tonight by winning the Royal Rumble back in January. That marks his second time winning that event. The momentum is behind John Cena as he picks up Rock for the side slam. The crowd is now behind John Cena. Pin, one, two, kick out by The Rock. Later on in this matchup, John Cena goes to the announcer table. He's ripping out monitors. 
Rocky Maivia is in trouble, folks. He is dazed, and Cena is just having his way as he throws him on the announcer's table. What is this? Cena going to the top row, flying elbow from the top row, flying elbow from the top row. John Cena just risked his life trying to get to the rock, and he did enough damage. John Cena is rolling with all the momentum right now. He whips Rocket to the corner, and there appears to be someone coming out. Could it be? Who is this? It's Stone Cold Steve Austin. Stone Cold Stunner for John Cena. And the Rock is turned around. Stone Cold Stunner for the Rock. Oh my goodness gracious. The Stone Cold Stunner for both superstars are days. Rocky gets up first and he gives them a rock bottom. He will win this matchup. John Cena clearly had this matchup won. What does this mean for the days ahead? I guess you got to tune in tomorrow for Raw. Oh no, what is this? Steve Austin again. He's countless is attacking The Rock, the champion, with his own belt. Stone Cold Steve Austin. Stone Cold Steve Austin clearly knocks out Rocky Maivia. Ladies and gentlemen, good night from New Jersey. In Jay Skills' video, I just Marty Mar. I, I know who Marty Mar is now. <laughs> like Marty Mar. Like like I I don't know if you if you try to make that like. This coach speaking. Talk to me. Hey, what's going on, coach? Yo, what's going on, Curtis? Man, I'm at the office looking at this feedback. How you doing? Yeah, I saw the feedback, too. It's all good. But I got your voicemail, and I do agree with you. I do think it's time for me to hang up the cleats. But I want you to start CJ2K in my position. Um, Moose is over here right now. We're playing Madden, and he said he wants you to start Mackie in his position also. All right, man. I'm going to make that happen. One more thing. Make sure they say his name twice. <laughs> Man, don't worry about that. I'm pretty sure they know to say the name twice by now. What's going on, people? It's the superhero of YouTube, your boy Jay. Back again in the fourth round of the Sports Commentators March Madness. Hold on a second. Mama, I made it. All the way to the Elite Eight, baby. Anyway, this is another Madden Ultimate Team gameplay. And this guy was so disrespectful. He came all the way to London wearing my 49ers jerseys. Mm -mm -mm. Anyway, there's a severe weather warning, slight chance of rain, and you all know the song. Nights like this, I wish raindrops would fall. Cocaine Eddie is over there guarding two people at the same damn time. You see him over there guarding two wide receivers at the same time. Yes, I had to repeat that because I don't think you all just realized what Cocaine Eddie just did. I was not able to score off of that turnover. He got the ball back. He scored. The score is now 7-0, but I'm not worried because I got this guy by the name of Mackie. Right now, currently, he does not have a nickname, but I should call this man crazy because look at what he does to the secondary. This man, hey, you better stop playing with that safety over over there stop diving son stop diving Mackie just burnt up the entire team and the screen another severe weather warning bad lightning and thunder then. who cares Holmes I just got tongue twisted I couldn't I don't have words to describe that hit what was you thinking guy so we all know the saying right lightning does not strike twice in the same spot but that does not mean it can't strike twice in the same stadium right <coughs> Medic! Oh my god, these guys are gonna need an oxygen tank out there because they're just getting hit left and right. So right now it's the second quarter and I came up with this idea. I'm only gonna use Mackie and you see J 2 k you can't see May burning you up the left side of the field. You can't stop this guy. So the entire game from here on out, I figured you know what? I'm only going to use Mackie and CJ2K the entire game just because he thought this was going to be an easy game because Curtis Martin and Moose was not playing. Right here, my defense goes to sleep. I don't know what they were doing, but nobody was playing in position. But again, we're not worried. And you know why we're not worried. Because I'm going right back. And he's still playing with that safety. Look at him at the top left-hand corner of the screen. Playing with the safety. Not paying attention to Mackie. Come on, man. Come on, man. 
You gotta pay attention. You better stop sleeping out there in safety. You better stop sleeping. Mackey still burning up the screen. He was not able to do anything on offense. I got the ball back and I'm not gonna take the foot off the gas pedal. I'm gonna keep the foot on his neck. You not going to breed. Look at Mackey get loose again. Mama, there go that man again. Look at Mackey burns the secondary on the right side of the field. What was you thinking? And this is why I love Madden Ultimate Team football in general because there's always something going on. He was able to get the ball back and use the hurry up offense, which I hate, and was able to get in position to get a great run up the middle by Matt Forte. We got a new thing that we're trying over here at my studios called Target Finder. No, not like Call of Duty, but it is Target Finder for Madden Ultimate Team. I'm trying to help you guys out, trying to help you find Maggie. And even though I put the target on the screen for him, he's still running over there almost out of bounds. Can we get an instant replay? Because there are some things that you may have missed. For instance, like this referee getting in the way. And Mackie with that great one hand catch on him. Three people still can't guard Mackie out there running circles around the defense. It's raining again. You know the song. Go ahead and sing it because I'm not going to sing it with you this time. Great interception by Night Train, but I'm only going to get ran down by no one other than Gene Upshaw. I don't get it. I don't know how. He's an offensive lineman catching my cornerback. This game is basically over with, done for, but we're not going to take our foot off his neck just yet. We haven't given you a great run play. It's a cold front coming in, and we have no other choice to give the ball to the coldest man on this game. CJ2K skating up the left side of the field. This man out here is so cold, looking like Wayne Gretzky out there on ice. He's just that cold, people. Changing night train lane rain to snow. This man is crazy. Anyway, people, we're out here changing the weather. We're out here changing lives. I hope you all enjoyed the video. I greatly appreciate all of the feedback from sports commentators, March Madness. Until the next video, it's your boy, Jay, and I am is out. What y'all thought I was done? Y'all crazy. I got eight seconds left. Anyway, look at the stats. It's your boy Jay. I'm Miz out, y'all.